Hello, somebody's. We are the, the Nobodies. What are we doing here tonight? Today, we are going to be listening to the great Greg Torini from Chaosium, the drummer. If you're subscribed to this channel, it is more likely that you're a Chaosium fan at this point. <laughs> yeah, we've played so much Chaosium that uh, you have no choice but to like them. But this is so far from Chaosium. Greg is a drummer, and he has so many different styles. And if you go on his page, he's playing styles from uh, like almost around the world. And he's someone we've labeled a drum god. Yeah, he's very, 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 very good and very... He's not He's not like the fastest drummer in the world, like the, some of these nutcases, but he is very skilled. Hey, speed isn't anything. Yeah, he goes around the world and he teaches classes. That's how good he is. I want to be taught by Greg Torini. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get right into this. I'm son. And I'm father. How come you never taught me? True. <laughs> Got the wrong guy. <laughs> he did teach me. I'm just trying to make him feel bad. What kind of drum is this? Stop. So, so you could definitely tell that this is an Asian song. I couldn't tell you Asian where culture. in Asia, though. Yeah, it could be anywhere. But it could be Taiwan, could be China, could be Japan, could be Hong India? Kong. Huh? Is, is India Asian? It is, right? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. But this is this is all the. Uh, this looks more Chinese. Yeah. I don't even know the name of the song. Mutianyu. Let's even... go with it. Yeah. <laughs> God, he, but you he see... fits with the rhythm. Yeah, can you see? It's a, it's crazy because uh, usually they don't put drums to Asian culture music. So it's like he could take a regular drum set and make it sound Asian. Yeah, the most you'll ever get is the giant freaking ball. Yeah, or whatever, like, you know, wood, wood percussion pieces they use. Yeah. But very rare do you actually get a drum set. Cymbals are definitely not a thing they use other than the the other giant cymbal they use. Yeah, yeah, the, the gong. <laughs> the China, they call it. They actually call it a China cymbal. Uh-huh. Ah, uh, he doesn't take a break. I I was thinking this to myself, right? Holy cow, man. If he, all he had was a pair of headphones in, and if it weren't for human limitation, he could do this for hours. I see it in his face. If this thing, if this track was on loop and he didn't have to worry about his hands, yeah, yeah, yeah. it would just be... You know, I love the way he, he brings down the sounds of like all the toms and everything. It's a very low sound. 
You know, it almost doesn't have a ring to it. It's almost a flat sound. And he uses, but, like, the big crash at the right moments. Yeah, yeah. The, but, yeah, he's got... And the cymbal work. Oh, my God. He's, like, so... He's almost offbeat, but yet he's on beat. He's, like, he's doing so many different quadruplets, quintuplets. He's, he's all over the place. It's, like, I don't even know where he's going next, but he's covering the whole entire drum set, which... You know, that that shows his skills. I could describe it as methodical. I think that's the word for it. Yeah. Yeah. Hours. Do it for hours. I was just looking into his eyes, man, and he is so focused. Yeah. Did you see him staring out? Like, look at that view he had. He had the he had the temple or whatever that the, the uh, what do they call that freaking thing in the middle? The, I could the not. gazebo. He had the gazebo in the middle, and with the beautiful background, and he's just looking out, and he's got the music in his ears, and he's just focused. Like he's all. Well, I don't know if he's looking out into. You know, the world, or if he's, like, concentrating in his mind, all right, what's the next beat? I'd like to know where he is in his head. He's in a trance right now. You know what I mean? What I like, what is, he, what is he thinking of when he's actually playing this? Is, is he thinking of the next, his next moves, or is he just looking out in serenity? See, I'm on the opposite side of this. I think he has, like, four very minimal things he keeps in mind, and then just lets his hands do the rest. Like, entirely just instinctual oh yeah you right think he's now. been playing that long i think he's been playing that long that there's something instinctual about this is he focused absolutely yeah he's focused but but, but i'm saying that's that's what the question i have what is he focusing on is he just focusing on serenity or is he focusing on the, the drum beat next but you're saying he's not the, doing the drum there beat. are certain piano songs where i just play the chords over you know, and over yeah, change them up a little i don't even think muscle about memory it. yeah muscle yeah. memory i think this song might be pure muscle memory That view. My man was feeling that boy. He was feeling. He himself. was feeling himself there, man. He lost him. He just said, "You know what? It's time to jam." Mm -hmm. Wow. That is the only part in this song where I think he was like, "Oh, time to get a little more heavy," and yeah. then he went back to not thinking about it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. As soon as yeah, he thought about it, like, "Yeah, right. I'm gonna freaking go crazy," and then he's like, "Wait a minute. I'm in an Asian song." Yeah. But dude, what? But now the symbol work. The tom work, the bass work, 
the just the all around drum work, uh, all over, off beats. His bass was like you. I couldn't even keep up with the bass because it was so off beat, and that's hard to to do because usually you play you know one, two, mm -hmm. two, you know what one one three. Yeah, it's one and three is usually the bass drum. He but, wasn't play. He was playing like one three four. But now we gotta look at the big picture. Who is his hairstylist? Yeah, yeah. And how much moose did he <laughs> and use? How much moose did he use? <laughs> Looks like a whole can to me. Yeah. Does he spray or does he use moose? <laughs> yeah. Is it a is it an up <laughs> is it or a, is it a back? Is it a back? <laughs> we want to know. Let us know, Greg. <laughs> All right. Remember to hit that like, subscribe button, and tell us down in the comment section below what songs we should listen to. And go support Chaosium, because this band has given us the world, and freaking we love them to death. And press the little bell next subscribe button to get notified every time we upload a video. I'm Son. And I'm Father. Rock on! Rock on.